So I'm booked in at um, Bridge Motorcycles Exeter, a pleasant young man called Cameron uh, just sorted me out, told me that uh, I've got somebody coming to visit and that's uh, Exeter Rider. Here I am talking to Exeter Rider, who's... Hello, uh, Andy. <laughs> We're meeting Here comes up, the video now. I can meeting see up now. for coffee and chat, and uh, most of it is unrepeatable in 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 front of people. Although for subscribers who membership, I oh, don't trust them. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. yeah it depends Members, how much. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The higher level people get uh, ex extra benefits. Absolutely. They get to hear the swearing. Yes, that's <laughs> right. Awesome. You can feel it moving. Huh? It's got a little bit of that uh, sideways thing you get on motor yeah, guzzies and right. BMWs. Right, I'm away. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Yeah. Oh, it's a cool bike. It yeah. really is. But I'm not going to attempt any more because I know my limitations. But yeah. At least you can say you sat on one. And sat on one, started it. It's quite something, isn't it? And I would be able to manage it if it had mids, but. Uh, yeah, so, they do make an R version of this, which yeah. has mid pegs. Oh, so there probably are mid pegs around somewhere. Yeah, if there is an option. You could source them, but I'm so. bet knowing Triumph, it'd probably be a better grand. Yeah, yeah, it's a, yeah. <laughs> At least. It, it's a different bike altogether. So it's a cool machine, yeah. And great for posing. Your yeah. Pose value is like a million dollars. I like the colour scheme on this one. It's nice, isn't it? Yeah, so this is the Storm version. A like little bit year. more strain than the, the, the Gold Line ones, I thought were a little bit too, too much um, bling. bling. Yeah. Hello. We're at Bridge Motorcycles, I'm with Exeter Rider, and we're perusing the, the machinery, and there's a couple of bikes here. This is one of the legacy models, isn't it? Yeah, it's got the panniers, which... It's mm. £8,000. A reduced price across the range. Oh, that one's got the engine bars. They don't look too bad. So the matte black BSA. Yeah, like the colour scheme. Um, as uh, Steve has just said, why are we tucked away in the second hand bit? Yeah, I used to own a, a, a legend. That was a lovely bike. That's the only bike I've ever written off, unfortunately. Oh, no. Yeah. These Thunderbird Sports, they've got a good reputation. Mm. Uh, it's old school triumph, isn't it? Yeah. You know, they're keeping their value very well. Yeah. So this is the Honda CBR650R. So this is the fared sports version of the CBR650, yeah? Yes. Yeah, with the electronic clutch. Yeah. Electronic clutch. So it's not a DCT? No, no. So basically when you come to a stop, you don't need to pull the clutch in. It just disengages. Right. And instead of the quick shifter, this is to my knowledge, instead of the quick shifter, change up and down and that will look after all of the, the clutching in for you. So is that an advance on a, on a DCT or a quick shift? It's different. It's just a different option. You know, just when you think that they thought of every option, this just adds something else. It's not a DCT. It basically takes the um, clutching in and out. You can still use the clutch in and out if you if want you to. Want. Okay. But at the same time, you've got the option not to use it. So. They have done a good job on that, I think. I some of the bikes these days are a bit too angular, but I think this one's. I think they're beautiful. It's okay. Yeah, it's yeah. okay. Yeah. yeah. I think it's stunning. I'm not yeah. a sports bike rider no. really, but I, those sort of things I really like. And yeah. also, the good thing with the Hondas the CBR range is that they're quite comfortable as well. I yeah. Find. You yeah. don't feel like there's too much weight on your wrist. No, and you're not being hammered by the suspension at the back. Yeah. The customer taking his new gold wing out here today. Right. <laughs> right. Lucky man. Just trying it, you just bought it. Whoa! And it's got the fancy suspension as well, hasn't it? Is it like they're all electronic, self leveling? It's amazing. Um, anyway, let's leave yeah. him to See, it. I was going to say, uh, yeah, it must be. Noticing in on this big yeah. yeah. It's a monster, isn't it? Well, I didn't want any of these, didn't do it. Yeah. I was going to love it. Came back in, it's smooth, it's powerful. But it's dumb. Yeah. I'm pulling away, stop here and pulling away your lady. Don't be in traffic, you can't, it's not, it's, no. it's not open road bike. Yeah. So, um, for, for me, if you want to do mileage, it's got the comfort, it's got the power, it's comfortable, yeah. And it goes, doesn't it? If you want to go. So the idea is, we're going to be travelling back with the side, yeah. yeah. It's, um, 
bit of, bit of noise from the front. Yeah. There's a little bit of a, and a, quite a bit of heat from the engine. Thicker, okay. Yeah, uh, maybe the aftermarket or whatever, but it's, I didn't yeah. want to like it. I'm glad it's not just me. And I did. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. What's your YouTube channel? Exeter Rider. Exeter Rider. And that's Cornish Motorcycle Diaries. Pleased to meet you. Cornish Motorcycle Diaries. Yeah. 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 Exeter Rider. So Exeter what's your, Rider. What's your well, I think you ought to be in commission there. I think you just sold it, didn't you? I, I always like meeting people and finding out their thoughts yeah. and see if they marry up with mine. And as it you know, give you like ideas, there, yeah, yeah, it's absolutely. Like, it's pretty much exactly what I think about it. So yeah. I know I'm on the right track. Yeah. Um, better leave you now, mate. All righty. <laughs> Good to see you, mate. All right. Good you luck too. With everything and, uh, see you soon, hopefully. Yeah. Yeah. No worries. Good luck with the bike. Yeah. Let us know when you got it back. Right. Yeah, well, I'll, I'll give it a thorough going over once I got it back, and hopefully that's dealt with all the stuff and it's in the past, yeah. and I'll be able to get on and enjoy yeah. my bike. And enjoy it a bit more. Yeah, yeah. Instead of feeling that slight tinge of apprehension when you go out and you think, mm, what's happening now? I should ride my BMW, yeah. <laughs> Every time I start it up, it sounds different. <laughs> There he goes, Steve, aka Extra Rider. What a top bloke. <laughs>